So the question which I was asked to answer was, what happens when you put an inductor in series with one of these lamps? So I've done that and I've added a switch so that I can short it out. And on the scope I've got the incoming voltage trace, blue, and the current, yellow. Now I'm obtaining the blue trace with this isolation module over here, which provides me an isolated signal of the mains waveform. So let's zoom in on the scope. There you go. Okay, so I'm going to switch in the inductor. As you can see, it has little effect on this region over here, where you can see the notch. Now what I'm going to do is turn the thing down till the lamp goes out and then you see that notch disappear. And as I slowly turn it back up, you can see that notch begin to reappear over there. And you can also see the regulator doing stuff. There's your notch, you know, we're at full voltage. Which is caused by that current spike. Then there's a second one over there. But it's at the crest. However, this one at the zero crossing point. That one's not good. So, there I've added a bit more context to my previous video. By adding an inductor obviously at one milli henry does nothing for this situation and that's pretty much going to wrap it up our time's up here so ladies and gentlemen take care have no some no further and i'll see you next time for more awesome stuff Alrighty, bye